Family Refugee Support Project has been in existence since around about 2000. At that time, it was providing a service for families from Kosovo that had come directly to Liverpool. It was recognised that traditional therapies might not really work with people that came from different places. So the first director of the project got some allotments and started working with families there. This is our most recent thing. So for the last 18 months, Mike, and Debbie and the rest of the team have been involved in creating this garden space. Some families we're working with are very traumatised and have got both physical and mental health issues. This garden's been created to allow people to access of all ages, all abilities, and it's a place that can be maintained relatively easily. It's a place that we hope brings people safety and a sense of being able to speak and just be. The idea of the Tatton Park project was to do something in the media that would really capture people's attention and raise awareness about the charity because the Tatton Show is attended by about 90,000 people and it's a big event in the North West. So we thought by taking a garden there which would showcase the work of what the charity do then it would really raise people's awareness of what the charity was about. I designed the garden, came up with the concept, discussed it with the team at FRSP and been responsible for project managing it from when we had the idea in autumn through to submitting the application in January and then getting all the materials together, finding a contractor and right from the beginning to the end really. Well it started off with quite a lot of design work finalising the concept and looking at materials and then getting all that approved by the RHS. And then once we found out we'd got a place at the show, it's been a question of raising money for it, which has come through a combination of fundraising events and asking suppliers to donate and loan us materials to help build the garden. The thing that we're creating in the greenhouse at the moment is what we're calling the skyline artwork and that is going on the back wall of the garden. It's about four metres long by two metres high and it's going to depict an abstract view of the Liverpool skyline which you can see from the garden um, just where I'm looking over there because obviously we're in Toxteth and we're quite high up and there's a, a really good view and we wanted people who visited the garden to know that it was a site in Liverpool, um, one that not many people see really, it's hidden from view, uh, like the lives of the refugee and asylum seeker families. So it was, um, yeah, to give it a geographical location really.